Oh, uh, yeah, that sounded really good, man. I don't know if he, he put an EQ or something on there, but uh, that, th that thing was thanging. Hey, man, like, oh, okay. Um, what up, yo? I go by the undeniable name of Damo, never been a lame. Oh, it's your boy, that boy, Bari. Jay will the podcast killer, man, a.k.a. Podcast Poppy, a.k.a. The Pie Father. This is Willow Wednesdays, man. You about to get some ghetto news from your relationship gurus. <laughs> Quick draw McGraw over here, you know? That's funny. You dig? Fellas, oh, what's man. the word? What's happening? What's, what's going happening? on? Chilling, chilling. Chilling, yeah. How is chilling, we doing? Chilling. I'm cool, man. This yeah, yeah, yeah. I any mean, um, any cool shit happen this week? The, any cool shit happen? Yeah. I don't know, yeah. man. Shit. Barry, anything cool happen to you this week? No, not much. Just a lot. Can't complain. Yeah, he just missed the live. He just missed the alley. All right, cool. Okay, man. <laughs> Never mind. Same old stuff. I feel you. You know what I mean? Well, regular right, shit, I guess. You know. Yeah. Regular. Yeah, regular, 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 baby. Yeah. Regular, regular. Listen, man, it, 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 it is what it is, and it, it, it is what it ain't either. I mean, it's the same shit. <laughs> I'm, just happy, I'm just happy to be here, you feel me? I'm just happy heard, to be here, man. Heard, heard you, King. Heard you, King. You you continue, you continue to flourish, you feel me, in, in your your endeavors. We'll say that. Right. Question, if a, if somebody if somebody not black says, what's go, says King to you, how do you feel about that? If somebody I, not black, I don't feel a way. Yeah, because you know, you know, like kings and queens, you know, and then oh. what if like uh, uh Asian? I feel like, like that's the right damn way it should be. But uh, okay, wait, so okay. so <laughs> a, so Asian and white people can't have kings and queens? I'm I'm confused. That's true. No, I'm not saying that, people. but I have heard, I definitely I have, white people. I just never heard a lot of white people address somebody else and be like, "Hey, king." No, nah, listen, I, I hey, I, queen. I feel okay. like we, we need to stop being so right. fucking sensitive as a people. No, I was just asking the question. I That's just right. never heard no, no, it. I'm not, I'm not coming crazy. at you. I'm not coming at you. I'm just saying if somebody ever felt the way that somebody non-black called them king or queen, they should check themselves because why the fuck are you so sensitive? Mm. Is what I'm saying. Ooh. Well, no. It okay. could almost because maybe it could be disrespectful. Well, I mean, but that's... You know what's the intent? How can be? I, I, I'm calling you king. That's disrespecting. Yeah, it could be sarcasm. Listen, people are weird, bro. How can that be disrespectful? Oh, I don't know, man. Racism and prejudice thinks... is a funny thing. <laughs> like, okay, so oh, 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 okay. If you say condescending, I can see that. But disrespectful, the king. Hey, king. Hey, yeah. king. Good morning, king. You like really, <laughs> Edgar? I, I, I. Mm. Stop being sensitive. That's what I'm going to say. <laughs> That's my take on it. We too fucking gotcha. sensitive. We just want to be... You know what it is? We just want to have feelings about shit. That's all it is. Everybody want to have a feeling about something. I'm tired of that. My mm -hmm. mom, uh, no, but my yeah. mom always said people be having too much feelings. Uh, that is true. I, I agree with too that. Much feelings, I, mm, which is yeah. a true thing. This how, is you, how you one person feel all this. This is right. a perfect segue. Y'all want us to get into it real quick? Let's do one. Let's talk about it. Yo, Amanda Seals okay. is, has been under fire these last 24 to 48 hours mm. uh, because of a role that she plays in a, a hit television show by the name of Insecure. I think we all are aware of this show. We're all great show. The show. Yeah, sure. Yeah, I, shout I, out to Issa Rae, all them, all yeah, them over there. Listen, shout, shout, shout out to Issa Rae. I think this was season five or last something season, like man. Season five. Yeah, I do, I, I do, do want to say this in, in all honesty. I have not watched one episode of this show. Boo. Yeah, I, I, listen, I, mm, I, I'm not a lot of the people. I have not watched one episode of this show, but this great, topic great, here. Great, great show. No, I, I've heard it. And honestly, I'm the kind of person, I want the show to be done and let it die down a little bit so then I could watch it without all the hype around it. It's been off for a year and a half. How? <laughs> this is season five. How has it been off? This no, it's the, 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 she didn't do a season last year. She let the whole year go. That's why this is kind of critical. Like, what, what? Okay, so what I'm saying is they, they still have episodes to go, right? The, right. So you want it to go away completely. Yes, so I can watch it in its entirety without social media or social influence bias. <sighs> and what happens is this is the same reason Yo, 
Dame, I think I just found the answer. Mm-hmm. To why, to why I, you don't watch TV. To why I don't watch what everyone watches at the same time. Mm-hmm. Because how the whole world right now is on BMF. I haven't watched the episode yet. I honestly want to wait till it's over so I can watch it all at once. I can binge it. I can digest it for myself. Right. And then I can have my own opinion on it. Mm. So that, that, that may have answered the reason why I never watch what everyone else is watching at the same time. But it's... Mm-hmm. Go ahead, my bad, because um, I know you got Amanda Seals. We got to yeah. talk about that. But I just want to point that, like, it's certain things I don't want to be a part of. Like, I'm cool on the latest episode of Love Hip Hop, Love Hip Hop, which I do watch a little bit. You watch that shit avidly. I watch it, yeah. No, only certain, uh, certain. I like Atlanta. You but, like Atlanta. You like a New York. You like LA. I like New York. You like, like Chicago. New York. I like New York. You like I Botswana. Like Botswana? <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> love hip hop Botswana. Yo, love hip hop Botswana. That's a thing. That's a thing. I know, like, Might as well be. Shit. shit, fuck it. Why not? Um, but no, because some of it I like to be part of the cultural phenomena. Some of it, because some of it is groundbreaking stuff. Like, um, some of it, not love hip hop, but sometimes, like the, the Dave Chappelle stuff, I want to be right on par with everybody. With, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Insecure, I want because it was you know it was groundbreaking ideas and thoughts, and it's cool yeah, to yeah. be part of the think piece at the time. Versus two years later, you like man, that's amazing. It's like well, yeah, we told you this two years ago. Okay, so so I will I will say this, um, uh, dear white people, uh huh. When that show came out, the whole world was on it. Mm-hmm. I sat back and I waited. I then followed up. It wasn't two years later, but I followed up and watched the whole thing. And the show or the. Uh... The show, yeah. The show, not the, yeah, the movie. It was a, it was a movie show. first. Yeah, I, I never saw a movie yeah, at all. Show. I just saw the show. Yeah, you like it, by the way? Just... I no, I did like it. Yeah. But I liked yeah. it for my own. I didn't like it for what everyone was saying about it week to week. Right. And I, I guess I, I, I guess that's just, that's just been me. It's always been me. So, okay, so let's get back to this Amanda let's Seals. get back story. to it. My bad, my bad. So, yeah, so uh, um, Amanda Seals plays a character by the name of Tiffany Dubois. And wow. Tiffany Dubois is a member of a sorority by the name of the AKAs. Mm-hmm. I don't know their whole name because I'm not a I'm not a Greek and I don't want to disrespect nobody. I mean, Alpha Kappa Alpha. There you go. Alpha Kappa Alpha. Right? Mm-hmm. I know their colors is pink and green, which to pink me is a green. weird it's a weird combination, but it works. Very um I, I've never just thought to put mm-hmm. together pink and green, but hey fuck it. It it, it Even works as colorful it, as y'all niggas socks be Y'all never I've, did pink and green. I've, I've never had pink and green, but fuck it, they make it look good. So shit. I, I, you too, Barry. You ain't never did no pink. And... I've never had my socks before. Yeah. I, th- I yeah. think that they are afraid a hard to color. have. It's a hard color. They probably hard afraid color. to have pink and green socks because the sorority gonna fuck them up. They don't want to get beat up by the sorority. Yeah. So what happened? My bad. I keep so. Up. So what happened now? Um, Amanda Seals, who is playing a character, she's an actress. Right. Um, she's playing a character who's in a sorority um she wore the colors and she had their letters on an article of clothing mm. uh the sorority went up in an uproar and have pretty much put this lady neck on a chopping block to say that she's disrespecting their sorority wow i wanted to bring it to y'all fellas so we could talk about it how do y'all feel about this by playing a character in a tv show that yes. somebody wrote and dressed you Yes, that's what you do in characters in TV shows. So if yes. you're a doctor, you wear doctor's clothes. <laughs> right? Yes. Okay. Not much to talk about with me. Oh, I don't okay. understand. I don't even understand why this is an issue. So please let me know. Listen, people. I I feel like in this day and age, everybody just wants to say something because they can say something. So I don't even see the issue. I don't even. It's one of the things. If I, I'm not the biggest fan of Amanda Seals, but if I was her, this is one of the moments where I wouldn't even have entertained the conversation. I'd have been like, Yeah, I've just been like, Okay, yeah, okay. <laughs> so yeah, you're, you're that, mad that, if that, I, I'm a bus driver and I got on a bus driving outfit. Like I don't just down. if I'm a janitor yeah, I and I, I'm wearing a lot of keys. Like, yeah, it's like they're like, Yo, you, <laughs> you're being you kids. fucked up. <laughs> you're <laughs> fucked up. You yeah. don't know what it's like to sweep the floor. Yeah, yeah what are you doing? I don't understand. So what is the so what? I, I, okay, so I will what's say what's the cost of paying on that? Like, I, what, okay, so if I go devil's advocate and I put my devil's advocate hat on, right? Um, a lot of people are saying that it is slightly fucked up. Um, 
you you didn't do what we did to wear those colors and to them they see it as a as a, as a source of pride and it, it's kind of the same reason why it's a crime to impersonate a police officer you cannot put on a police officer uniform and drive a cop car yeah in real life but in a movie <laughs> no 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 i no, I, I get it I, no, yeah. once again once again this is devil's advocate I, i'm yeah, not saying yeah, this yeah. is my point but right. we wouldn't have a show if all three of us thought the same Right. right. So for for the record, I think I'm, with, I'm with you, right? I'm with you. This is okay. dumb as shit. Once again, we started the whole show saying everybody got feelings. Right. Mm-hmm. It is too much goddamn feelings. But too if much. we if we were to go devil's advocate, um, someone could say, I did this, 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 and this to get these. To, I, I I got those colors. I'm wearing those letters. Okay. How about someone in the military? I I fought in every single war ever to wear this army fatigue, and now y'all just wearing army fatigue for fashion. What if they feel away? Not even that. So now you gonna beat up Sylvester Stallone for playing Rainbow? You you know what I'm saying? You, not. I mean, but a lot of people did. There, there was there was pushback for that. If you want to bring that up, there definitely was. <laughs> bro, I mean, there bro, was. I'm gonna keep it a buck with you, bro. It, it's like it, it it gotta be one of them things where it's like your dog you. I feel like you got too much damn time. I understand you trying to play devil's advocate, Willow, but you yeah, just I'm, got I'm too much damn. Advocate. Not you. You tr- you trying, but even still, with you trying, and I and I give you an A for effort, but it's still some bullshit. It don't matter. It is a movie, a TV <laughs> show. It's not like I'm since out paid. here, I'm a right. a- I, It's not like since out here, like I'm a AKA. No, since it's like okay, you're paying me a check to right. play someone who's an AKA. You know what I'm saying? It's not like she out here claiming this shit for real. That's it. People got too much goddamn time. You know what? You got too much time on your hands to feel away. I would say if the individual who is portraying to be in the sorority or fraternity or whatever Greek affiliation there is, if they were disrespectful in that role, I would say, hey, we don't don't act like that. Fuck out of here. That's some bullshit. I would see She didn't even say nothing, aka-ish. I saw the show. She She just had the outfit on. Like, that was Wait, wait, so question. This is a real question. Okay. Did she look good wearing the outfit? Well, Amanda Seal is cute anyway, you know, so. So she did look good. She always look there. good. She's, okay, she's so that, girl. so I, I'm going to say this, and, and a lot of people might not want to talk about it, but it could be just that. That she looked better than them? She looked a she lot looked better. better than them in it. Well, and, I, see, Amanda Seal is really pretty, uh, but they play her look, like her role, She's her looks are played down. So she's not, I mean, but they, they they have to because she is she is pretty. But she yeah, do a lot of. I'm just saying, play, I'm just saying, you know, just as, as far as her character, her character is more of the the chill character. She the one who jokes don't hit, you know, and they kind of fake laugh, you know, like that's the yeah. joke. Yeah, she's that character. Well, but. you know what? Okay, well, I'm gonna go with you, right? But it's not gonna be the pretty part. Maybe the reason why people are targeting her, especially about the AKA thing, is because, like you said, you had said something right before you got cut off. She does a lot of fuck shit. Period. No, she no, she, she does. Has done a well, Amanda Seal. Period. Yes. Oh yeah. yeah she said a lot of. I Amanda Seal says a, she, she says said, a lot oh, yeah, of yeah, fuck yeah, 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 yeah. She says some shit that I agree with, but then she says a lot of shit that I don't agree with. You know what I'm right. saying? So a lot of people have mixed opinions about her. So maybe because niggas don't per se fuck with her as a person, now right. they're looking for any excuse now, even in something that she's playing I a agree. role in. I can see that one. You know what I'm saying? I agree. Yeah. Maybe that's just because it's Amanda Seal. Period. Yeah. Yeah, because yeah. but in, Listen, in this regard, a, it's like a, a lot of times it's not the message, it's the messenger. Right. And in this situation, right. it may be just the me- the world. Well, not the world. A lot of people don't fuck with Amanda Seals for X, Y, they and Z. Don't. Right. And it is what for it is. Some reasons, right. And I think that could be what's spilling over because you can't get mad for somebody wearing pink and green and being paid to play a role. Because if that's the case, I can get mad at any actor or actress for playing anybody right right shit uncle phil for wearing judge's robe fucking carl winslow yeah, I, for being shit, the cop. Uh, you know like what are we talking about that was halle berry for being Catwoman. i can get yeah, mad like, at that i, I get mad at anybody for playing a role because ridiculous. you ain't earned that that suit <laughs> yeah that's ridiculous yeah, I, didn't okay. earn, I didn't have to earn this maybe and, and maybe, if you like want to be crazy i did earn this suit i became an actor i did multiple movies yeah. i deserve to play this role you talking about because now Heath Dude. Heath Ledger is you know gone. Saying? Heath Ledger has died from playing right. and acting a role. That's it. 
So what we mad at him for that? No, but I am gonna be mad at this new dude to play Batman. I I, I do kind of feel away. Just want to say this. Well, to, to be honest, I, I feel like they've never gotten Batman right because we always are mad at Batman. <laughs> well, they got, it. They got it right the, with Michael Keaton. I saw the trailer. Bro, when has the world the been trailer? happy with Batman? I, no, they they when they it was like Michael Christian Keaton Bale's Batman. Michael Keaton. The world bro. did like Christian Bale Batman. They like Christian Bale second after they, Michael Keaton. And that's Bye. it. They like Christian Bale's Batman. Bro, there's, there's been 18 I, Batman since 1912. <laughs> <laughs> I like saw, did of. you watch, y'all saw the trailer? Y'all saw the trailer for the new I Batman? Did. I did. I, I, I refuse to. It's just too many goddamn Batmans. I'm okay. I, I'm, I'm kind of like, why are they still telling new Batmans? I feel yeah, like, like, bro, how many fucking Batman no, stories because, do we need, bro? Because remember, is there's, there's Marvel, then there's DC, then there's. I'm, I'm good. Warner Brothers is different. It's different. Versions of I'm the Batman. Good. That's why I'm, they I'm tell good. different. This stories. is why I honest, stopped, I'm good on Batman it. too. This like, is I why I stopped could, watching Power. There's they could give <laughs> Batman a couple years off. Like they just could. Like I'd be cool not seeing another Batman for another five years. Can we get a spinoff? Can I get a Batman Junior? Can he have a kid? Like I'd rather give me a new story. They, 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 give me something. They you know they were supposed to do. To I don't know if they the still Flash. gonna do it, but they were supposed to do they um. Flash movie. You remember Batman Beyond? Where he yeah. turned where, where Batman got old and he had the other dude, the black with the red. Yeah. They're supposed to be doing a black a Batman Beyond. Um give me something Robin. New. Supposed to get his spin-off called yeah, I, I, the give, Nightwing give me, or some shit. Give me Robin. Robin. I'll I'll watch a Robin movie. Give me Robin. Yeah. Shit. I, how many Batmans well, yeah, I gotta watch? So, I'm over Amanda, Batman. like I said, Amanda Amanda Seal. Shorty, don't even pay that no mind because that's fuck shit. That, that, well, uh, to be that honest, is literally, that is literally fuck shit. I, but at the at the same time, my mom always said, if you do some bullshit, some bullshit gonna happen to you. My mom oh, no, has, sure. oh, she, and and I think this is her. <laughs> this, this is just her chickens coming home to roost because she done did a lot of fuck shit. No, true. Like <laughs> I said, yeah, like I said, she. When she did the, uh, when she when she claimed that this dude that, that I, I remember the biggest thing was when she claimed that the the the, the football player, the ex football player, raped her, or sexually assaulted her, and then she came out and said, "Oh, she only told that story from the viewpoint of the woman who was actually sexually assaulted. I I didn't get sexually assaulted. I just said it was me because I needed the story to get attention. Some off the wall wild shit." And then just, people were like, yeah. "But you don't." You said that my phone went crazy. Like <laughs> You know she no, be My I phone was like, get 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 her the fuck out of here. <laughs> no, I don't know. I don't, Pack her I, the fuck I, up. I don't know if y'all remember that story because no, when I, it came the, out, the, the was world like, oh, remembers that. Crucify son, it's over for him because everybody like, oh, you rape a woman, it's over, bro. But then all of a sudden, when they did the research and he proving his points, like I never touched her. He's like, nah, it wasn't me. It was another girl. I was just speaking on her behalf, and then the I girl was who acting. claimed that he raped her. I was eh, acting. Eh, 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 eh. <laughs> Get out of here. I was acting. <laughs> she was acting. She won that role yeah, too. That I was wild. acting. She won that role too. Huh? No, but but the, <laughs> that's all I'm trying to say. People people mad because you portraying them in certain ways. Like nah, fuck out of here. I mean, look, okay. So all in all, I do want to say this world is too fucking sensitive. Uh, everybody got feelings, and we want to just show how much we feel. And I feel like we need to cut the feelings back. But at the same time, yes, social media is blurring reality and entertainment. Yeah, and, be- yeah I agree. and and because of that, we don't know what the fuck or how the fuck to feel. And the simple-minded individual will take it, take entertainment as reality, and be mad about it. You be you feel right about the wrong shit, which is retarded and and you believe that the, the the right shit that you feel is right even though it's wrong yeah i said it right mm-hmm. i don't know well, something like that well speaking of let's um let's let's talk about dave Chappelle, man because uh oh shit we kind of got the same concept going, going segway on yeah you saw that so i did that so i, I like that. that that was that was very journalist j- journalistic of you yeah well you know i'll be i'll be out here journalizing mm-hmm <laughs> you know what you know what certain <laughs> topics are like you know what I've been journalizing are like, like, journalizing you know, that's, uh... <laughs> you know when certain things it's just like after a certain point it's like oh yeah it's like beating a dead horse it's, you know what i'm saying it's like why does why does this even have to be a conversation at this point somebody said right. something just like when you guys say something 
that's it. It is what it is, and it's cool. This man no, said but, something. But, it is what but it is. But in, in this situation, it does keep multiplying. So I hear what you're saying, but the conversation changes because the situation. Yeah, changed. it it changed because now yeah, it, it, it does change, Barry. So this is slightly different than that. Did you? It, did you? Did you, oh, first off, he didn't even watch first, it. That's what I was saying. When we first watched it, or first talked about it, did you watch it? Barry oh, hasn't watched it. Yeah, watch this stand up. Boy, lying like shit. Watch you lying like we shit. We had a whole half hour special talking about. But you did shit. watch it. You, you uh, didn't even speak. Yeah. At the time, I think Jay, you hadn't. You don't even it. remember, drunky. I mean, you shit. So drunk. fuck you. <laughs> fuck you. <laughs> nah, I'm joking. Talking about um, you, so you, I, I ain't see it. You don't even remember talking about it. Look, I, mean, I don't, but I saw it. <laughs> <laughs> fuck out of here. Got some nerve. But I saw right. it. <laughs> So he pretty much set them up to hang. He set up the trans community to like hang themselves, and yes. and that's kind of what they're doing. And 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 it, and it's like mm-hmm. he said it in the stand up. He said, "If you actually listen, I'm not even talking about you. I'm actually talking about black people and our plight. And yeah. I'm I'm actually envious of you. And we talked about that. And it, yeah. you know, definitely t- t- because you you can get your issues dealt with faster. And he was like, um. But the problem is, is that you don't listen. <laughs> it's like you don't listen. It, 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 it goes. A, a step you don't hear what I'm saying. You're not even listening and watching a, what a, I'm a, saying. A, yeah, it's a, crazy. A step, a step beyond that is they didn't. They don't even watch the special. Mm-hmm. So he's like, I have three stipulations. Right. One of them is don't come see this film if you have not watched the stand up. Right. Because it's like we're having an unfair conversation. It's like if you're going to hold me to some shit that's been said 10 years ago and you're not watching what I'm saying now, then we can't have a conversation to get better. Right, right, right. Because they was trying to say that uh, they was trying to say that they reached out to have a conversation with him and he didn't respond. Mm-hmm. And he was like, um, well, yeah, number one, basically, he just was fighting what they said. All right, cool. So I didn't get a response. But if I did, um, I would have. And But these are the stipulations. You're right. And I like no, no. That he did say one thing. He did say one thing out of all of that. I liked all the things he said, but the one thing that stood out to me, he said, "You're not gonna summon me." That right. I did like. He said, "You're not gonna just come. <laughs> that's a man. You're not gonna shit. just summon me to show up." <laughs> no, but he said, if you want to have a conversation, we can have a conversation. But you're not gonna just to, check to be me honest, like I'm some little ass boy and tell me to pull but, up. But that's ego. That's that's hey, I'm Dave Chappelle. You're wildin'. The fuck you talking about? <laughs> like that's definitely a little bit. He of said, ego. if you want to have a conversation, yeah, that's ego. But that's, that's ego man. right there. No, it's, but it's exact, also like, it's exactly I'm not no, I'm not no punk ass little shit. dude. You ain't just gonna be like, yeah, come here and be... show up and you're like, okay. No, like, we can be grown no, and civil about yeah. this. Oh, that's valid. And let's have a that's conversation. Valid. Let's talk okay, about just it. Just what Dave said, that's some, that's some man shit. Check this out. Cool. If you want to have a conversation, you hit me up. Hey, yo, let's talk because I didn't like what you said and clearly you don't like some of the things that we be saying. Cool. But don't, oh, you have to come talk to us. Check this out. I don't gotta come talk to nobody. Yeah, like we all feel like that. It's comfortable in my crib, comfortably fine. You know what I'm saying? So, but I I love it though, man. All in all, I'm excited to see this film, this documentary. It's it's coming to Atlanta in uh, the second week of November. Mm -hmm. I will be in attendance. I I I can't wait to see it. It's it's gonna be great. Honestly, I I just want this conversation to be done, and I want. I kind of want what Dave Chappelle wants. And if low key, if we're listening to what he's saying, he wants the same thing. He wants both the plights to join forces right. and take over the fucking world. It's like, bro, y'all have made so much strides and so much advancement in this short amount of time. If we take that mixed with a little bit of, 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 of discrimination and segregation, we can take over this world and make it a better place. Right. So why not do that? Transgender people, they, they I don't want to say that they're just like they're not black people or the black plight of black people, but they understand what we go through because they've been discriminated well, discriminated well, broke it down, discriminated against. Well he broke yeah, it down so in the in the in they the, do understand. He broke it down in the in the show. At the end of the day, if you play the LGBTQ trans game, you can still be white. 
and, and win and win and and yeah. that's what it like mm-hmm. literally that's the one thing that everybody's missing it's like the, the fact that this is even a problem is because you can be white it just shows that you can just jump on the white side get in the white line and i'm white <laughs> and once you're white you're your priority he said, he said crazy. It's they don't see you as lgbtq you... and lgbtq plus they see you as white yeah and right. because of that you trump all and that's his that's his plight. He's like, yo, y'all don't see this here? Right. Y'all don't see that? Yeah, you fighting for LGBTQ+, plus, right. but as soon as you play the white card, it trumps it all, and there's mm-hmm. no more LGBTQ+. Plus. You're just a white individual in distress. Right. And the world comes to your, your aid. And and, you're, and you are said, automatically priority. It. Automatically, he no matter what. You. But that same black individual Everybody's don't a- get that. He said everybody's a minority until it's not convenient for them. You know what I'm saying? And that and that's the perfect example for the situation. You, that's you facts. play you can play the card of feeling a way which you have a right to do if you're right. being discriminated and hated against, you have a right to do so. But the moment that it that card doesn't play in your favor, now all of a sudden it's oh, but and it, and and one thing I always say, you can maybe you can change the gender if you feel like, maybe you can Change who you're attracted to, but you can never change the fact that you're black or you're white. You know what I'm saying? Well, no, and, no, you you can't say that. You can't say that because shit. I'm about to self-identify as a 35 year old Jewish man by the name of right, um, but, but what of is it? Josh well, Goldenstein, and but, I want to own multiple but businesses but, and but, own multiple but, apartments. But why you can start with that job? But guess what? Wait, why, wait, you wait, could, why are you holding the screwdriver? You can do that. <laughs> you can why do are you that. holding the screwdriver? Because you could do that, but it doesn't change the fact that they still gonna see your black ass first with them goddamn blonde dreads in your head. I so you could the... be identify as you want. Mm-hmm. You, you you done Barry the Builder <laughs> in a little workshop. I'm building you. I'm building you some knowledge, motherfucker. <laughs> Shit, you got a Phillips f- screwdriver. It's just in his hand. <laughs> now I was gonna say, um, you say you a Jewish. It's you you starting with that hat. You, you start, and that's the beginning. You know how they always well, had a, a, a fucking a fisherman's hat. <laughs> they, they, the Jewish people, they always had them hats. And they go fishing. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, the Jewish people fish. I th- I don't think so, but I don't, I don't know. They, I don't know. They don't do that. <laughs> they don't do that. They pay somebody to go fishing for them. <laughs> oh wow! That's the Jewish do. people fish. I don't think Jewish <laughs> you know people fish. What made me think about that? But now that you say it, I ain't never think I've seen. I don't think Jewish people. Couple of fish. Jewish people on the on the lagoon. You know, you know what's funny? <laughs> I, I see a lot of black people fishing. Black people fish. Yeah, black people fish. Black people some fishing motherfuckers. What, uh, that typical regular average American white people. I just had to watch how I said that. They fish also. Wow. <laughs> Yo, you tiptoed around that, <laughs> nigga. Because I'm I'm trying to make a, a, a difference without being discriminatory. Aha. Uh-huh. See, see how hard you, you okay. see how tough you, this is. I see your D E and I. Um, you know, <laughs> your your classes are coming in. Yeah, I'm I'm I'm, I'm corporate. I'm in the corporate job. You said now. your D E and I. Yes, your your diversity, equality, and inclusion. Yes, I uh-huh. see it. Oh yeah, you, that's corporate talk. Your your training is coming in. I see it, sir. Word, because if this was three years ago, I'd have been like, do you know, but <laughs> we get it. everybody. <laughs> yeah. So, no, no, but, um, yeah, that, uh, man, forgot where I was at because my head went in six different places. Well, I want to look gotta, up, I got a ratchet. I want to look up Jewish fishermen now. <laughs> oh, well, listen, if you look up a Jewish fisherman, um, <laughs> my bad, That's you weird. might find half the niggas in the Bible. They was Jewish, no, because they definitely. They, was they definitely did fish. There was fishermen in the Bible, no? Of course. Mm-hmm. Shit. Jesus might Peter be in that a, list. Peter was a Peter was a fisherman. Uh, sure. Was Peter Jewish? They were all Jewish. There you go. Half the Bible. Yeah, they all fishermen. They, they in the Fisherman Hall of Fame. <laughs> 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 That's funny. Them niggas caught all the fish. You know, Jonah and the whale? It's a fish. Yep. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Hey, Jonah was you. All right. <laughs> Old man who who was who was trying to catch a fish with a piece of stick and string. Just a mm, one piece I've done of that. trees trees. Wow, you went to a you went you to Jamaican. A stick. <laughs> no. <laughs> nah, I'm just 
uh, my dad had a a, a little lagoon. Wait, 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 so wait, 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 Everybody, no, this wait, Bari, 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 wait, wait. Everybody in this chat right now, if you had a dad, raise your hand. That sounds crazy to say. Don't even say no shit no, like that. No, I'm just, it's, it's real. You had a dad? That's crazy. Wow. I did, yeah. My dad was Jewish. Oh, okay. <laughs> I had a Jewish dad. Um, No, no, I'm joking. <laughs> <laughs> Um, no, 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 but but uh, he my dad had a little lake lagoon thing behind his house, and and he owned a lake. No, oh, no, oh, no, nah. no, no, wait, no, wait no. a minute, wait a minute, no, no, don't get that confused. Maybe he was, no, 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 bro, no, no. your pops <laughs> no, no. owned a lake. No, he had an apartment, and behind his apartment, it was money, some water. No, you got a money, bro, you got money. <laughs> so, wait, dad, so y'all had a stick. My thing is, it's a stick. I'm gonna get to that. A yeah, yeah. Behind my dad's one bedroom apartment <laughs> was, was a, a, a body of water that, and, that was um, on his property. Okay. I mean, he had an apartment. I guess I don't know. No, no. But in the back of it, it um, it was a, it was a, some water, and um, he had taught me how to fish, and so once he had taught like just regular fishing, and then. Um, he taught me how he used to learn at, on some old southern shit because my dad is from Arkansas for real, old southern man from Arkansas. He showed me how to tie the string on the stick and go fishing and toss it in. And he told me that, and I actually did that. And I actually caught a fish like that one time on a damn stick. I swear, that's what's up, man. I, 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 Weird chick, I, I respect it. That's some hard, he wasn't shit. there. That's some hard <laughs> shit to do, yeah, yeah. He wasn't yeah, there. He yeah, didn't believe yeah, me, yeah. which is some bullshit. But he wasn't there, but he you taught you how to fish with a string. He taught me how to do it, but when I finally did it on my own, yeah, I don't yeah, I it want to hear that. Your your pops taught you some shit. He taught me a lot of shit, mostly sexual stuff, but with girls. Let me clear that up. Okay, whoa, I was about to say, wait a minute. <laughs> <laughs> let me let me clear that up. Let me, women, wait sexual a girls. minute. <laughs> You know what? Uh, what's it? Uh, uh Clear what, that up. What's your random? What's your random question? <laughs> I, 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 Fuck no, I, that. What's your random question? That's that's what I was going to talk about. Question, <laughs> Here go Barry try to over talk again. You not in the studio no more, nigga. Get nah, over. You got a mic. You got a mic. You got to wait. I don't we care. outside, nigga. I don't care. <laughs> we outside. <laughs> Jay got a mic. Listen, I. Listen, I'm gonna push a button and shut the whole shit down. No, you gonna you <laughs> gonna shut you your shit with? down. <laughs> You know, my random question was the conversation we was having before the show started um, okay. with these oh. uh, police officers who ran up in the crib in Chicago. Can we oh. talk about that? Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. What happened with yeah, that? Was, can, can we talk about that? So pretty much this mother, she I guess she works overnight. She left her kids home while she went to work. And the police raided the house because they thought somebody else lived there. Wrong false information, wrong information. It was the wrong house, from period. A CI. It was the wrong house, period. Jesus Christ. That's how Brianna Taylor died. You know what I'm saying? So they wrong house, period. Yeah. They ran up in the house, and the little girl, like I told you, said, yo, not again. And then the police rounded them up, made them lay on the floor, got AR-15s, artillery, assault rifles in their face, asking them questions. Mind you, the oldest kid is like 14, 15. There's a little, a little kid no more than eight, another one that's probably like 10, 11. And they asking them questions with AR-15s and... Like I said, assault rifles in their faces. That's and crazy. they sued the city. And this was the third time it happened to them, mind you. Mm. The first two times, the city swept it under the rug, whatever, said, oh, sorry, I apologize. But for it to happen three times, and she went to the news, and it got caught, the, the police commissioner of Chicago called when and said, yeah, this is unacceptable. Right. Of course, because it looks crazy on the news. Yeah, you got to you got at least say it. happening. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? This is unacceptable. Oh, I'm something. sorry for the mob. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? They got to say something. So, of course, she sued the city. And because of how crazy it looked, because, they, mind you, not only did they come break into the house with just kids in there and they have assault rifles in front of these kids, they're questioning the kids in front of the parent, without a parent or a guardian present. So, without besides all of that, they won two point, they settled for 2.5 mil. Um, you should have started with that. I was telling. 2.5 so, oh, million so now. now 
It happened I, three times. I, I, I take two, 2.5 to be ruffled up a little bit. <laughs> $2.5 million. Right. So then so then now the question I said, I also say, yo, there's a dude in Vegas who got a, a sign that says if you kick him in the nuts and you make him and you don't make him fall to the floor, you gotta pay him twenty dollars. But if you do if you do make him fall to the floor for kicking him in the nuts, he has to give you twenty dollars. Hmm. And y'all said, check this out. And y'all said, I'd rather get the guns in my face for the two point five mil and maybe get shot. Whereas you getting kicked in the nuts is a guarantee a guarantee pay. Listen, I, I don't care how you try to spin it. I'm I still stand with what I said. I would rather a gun drawn on me instead of getting kicked in the nuts. I'm just this transition is hilarious to me. <laughs> Cause mind you, we, we just hit niggas with some news, right? right. <laughs> Yo, when we say ghetto news, nigga, like <laughs> ghetto news. We hit niggas right? with news. This story and then... with these kids and these guns, and then it's like, so do you want to get kicked you, in you, your you balls? Get kicked in your nuts. <laughs> Or guns drawn on you. What the? F- okay. So cool. All right. So this cool, right? Went. So we got. Welcome so we, to Willow Wednesday. So that's everybody. where we went, right? But then we Bro, went. We took the it a step further. Driver right? down. <laughs> we have weapons of destruction. No, no. So we went no from. The, we went from. Well, we went from that to 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 to, to getting kicked in the nuts period, and then we talked about Charlie horses. Oh, so man. now. Wait, 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 wait. Let, I got a stay. serious question. No, but let's stay there first before we move. We are moving fast, point. brother. We, we we didn't even talk about because the first. We, I thought we the moving main faster question was than the Tyler Perry script. <laughs> I thought I thought the main question was the Charlie horses versus the kick to the nuts. That's what I thought it was. That's we what gonna I get there. We gonna ride. But, you know, but we got, we, we gonna get there eventually. But we gonna get there. Can we talk about the first statement first? <laughs> Damn, Barry. Mediator, I moderator, thought, I roll call, selective snitching, temporary level, always toxic, half a gas station pill, Barbie. Goddamn. Nah, but so I. Damn. Did you want to say something about the the Chicago shit or? No, okay. So I I did I did want to say that Chicago police, the CPD has been corrupt our, our whole lives and Dame's whole life and Dame, period everybody whole life. They was ran by the mob. And yeah. that started the corruption, and you know, it, it's, it's always been corrupt. Always. So Chicago's for, always been corrupt. For me to hear that Chicago police done did some wild shit is kind of the same feeling I get when I hear that a random person in Florida did some stupid shit. It's the same thing to me. Yeah, like it's, it's just that's what they do. Niggas in, like, niggas really, in Florida, that, stupid. Niggas in Florida wild <laughs> out, and and cops in Chicago are corrupt. It's the same thing to me. That's true. So it, it, the, the story didn't surprise me. Um, but when you bring in the dollar amount and you said that they settled for 2.5 to me, now I'm like, okay, wait a minute. So a black family just got rewarded 2.5 for going through a traumatic experience. Now, I've been through a lot of traumatic experiences in my life, and I've never been rewarded by the city nor the state. So if if you were talking about being rewarded 2.5 million for somebody breaking into my house, I'll take it. Not to say that it's right, but I will take it. Would you would you let him hit you in the face? No. Okay. Well, no, 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 no. Yes, I would. For two point five, <laughs> two point five million dollars. <laughs> two point five million dollars. Look at my face, my bad, bro. But it's like wait, wait, hit wait. him in the face. And you gotta wait, be like, well, I gotta so, take this part. All right. So all right. wait, wait, wait. Bro, I've been punched for free. I've been in plenty <laughs> of fights in my life. You've never no, been no, punched no, no, before? no, no, no. They gotta no, they gotta gun butt you. Get on the ground. Okay, see, see, you change you changing the goalpost. He said you, you're moving the goalpost. You're moving the goalpost, bro. Because we didn't say gun but you know. Face. Oh well, no, yeah. It's technically it was hit in the face. We didn't say hit with what. Honestly, I, yeah, I, I still take the I take the gun butt. I still take the gun butt for two point five million dollars. Right, for two point five million, I take it. So a nigga so a nigga could gun butt you for some yo, that's crazy. Nigga, I didn't have you know how long I had a lump on my head, bro. I, I don't <laughs> like. I'm totally. Bro, how about this? This look like a gun butt, bro. I just be like, how about, see. How about this, this guy, bro? Every week, I just right? be like, two point five million. Oh no, 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 no! Put put your hat back on. Put your hat back on. He's, <laughs> he's wilding. Put your hat back on. Hey man, two point five. He is wilding. You see how my soul jumped out? I was <laughs> like, fuck it, fuck it, fuck it. Two point five million, nigga. <laughs> my gun butt. The world did not need to see that, bro. Oh, they've seen it. 
<laughs> They've seen it. Yo, relax. Oh. You gotta relax, bro. The world did not have to see Yo, that. That nigga said, I've been had one on my. <laughs> <laughs> Nice. <laughs> All right. Yo. <laughs> nah, that's funny. Yo. That is funny. That's funny. Okay, cool. All right. My damn hat done fell off. I that gotta readjust my hat. That was good. Bari, that was good. No, that was good. I didn't expect that. No, <sighs> nah, because Dave, you took the hat over and said, you don't see it. Nah, that shit was crazy, bro. Don't do that don't no more. Um, that, that shit look like a fucking trampoline on the side of your head, bro. That yeah. shit was just there. Oh, apparently that's where my thoughts come from at this point. Nah, for real. <laughs> <laughs> nah, that, listen, you gotta get like shit. every you new gotta, thought nigga comes straight care out of, of bro. That's another Yo. head, nigga. That is. Oh shit! Yeah, shit. gotta get that <laughs> taken care of. Crazy, boy. Um, but to bring it back, this nigga, Dave is crazy. Two point five mil. Y- uh, y- y- y'all, y'all going for it? Yeah. I'm, I'm, to do uh, this twice? Uh, sure. Mm. And then, um, so, the conversation mm. was that, or being kicked in your nuts like your like your man from uh, L.A. who who get kicked in the nuts for the money. What's worse, guns drawn, scaring you could possibly kill you, or getting kicked in the balls. I never, bro. I've had some, and well, the the kids nowadays call them ops. I've had some ops in my life. Okay. I will never wish that pain on my ops. Oh, getting kicked in the nuts. Yes, I would never want another man. Yeah. To experience being kicked in their nuts. And you know what's crazy to follow what you, that's crazy. Niggas in a fight and he don't like you. He still won't kick you in the nuts. The nigga won't Do you like know you. that? Yo, on some real. If like I a nigga won't even like you. Do you know he's that? It's, it's, no, it's respect. He still we respect that pain that so much. Bro. That that nigga though will hate your guts. Yo, but he be like, you just hit on something that's see you real. Hit him in the nuts. Niggas would be like, yo, bro, you hit him in the nuts. I no, because like no, 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 like, now you, bro. Now, but now you violated and we should jump you because <laughs> yeah. you bro- you broke the rules of the fight. I'm gonna be honest with, with what I just thought about. Motherfuckers will kill you before but kicking kick you, you in the, the balls, the... bro. Hey, like, that's a fact. That's crazy. That is a fact. You can shoot the shit out of you, but we'll not kick you bro, in the nuts, bro. I play. I play football in high school. <laughs> I played football in high school. I was not wearing a cup. Yo. I remember it. there was a game. I did some kind of move or whatever the case may be. Yeah. <clears throat> I got hit in my nuts. Helmet. Boom. Felt all that pain. When I'm saying I literally thought I was in heaven, I died. I was in heaven. Hey, I, I woke up. God was there welcoming me into the, the, oh, the, the pearly gates. Shit. Bro, that he is a pain. That, we said bro. that joke earlier. I think oh, that, is, that, that is a pain. Wouldn't hurt as much as getting kicked in the nuts. No, no, I, I'd rather die before being kicked in my nuts. I'm dead serious. So if think... it's, if you're talking about the Chicago police waving some guns in my face, I'll, I'll take that. I'd rather take, I'll take that. that. I'll take some guns as long as they don't shoot. You yeah, know. Don't shoot me. Don't shoot. You know. And it, how oh. about how about this? I go a step further. If you shoot, shoot the kill so I feel nothing. Because if you kick me in the nuts, I'm gonna feel something. Facts. Yeah. Yeah. If I'm dead, I'm just dead. Yes. <laughs> what they say, you wake up dead. <laughs> you wake up dead. So I you, ever been, you ever been kicked in the nuts? Nah, bro. That is yeah. different. Yeah. That is different. So it's okay. So 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 remember. All right, cool. Shoot me. Talk about <laughs> kill me, dead. <laughs> Don't kick me in my nuts. That pain lingers. So, so, so then we were trying to see what's about worse. Pain. Right. We were talking about having a catching a Charlie horse and then catching a Charlie War horse while having sex. Oh. And we was like, fuck whatever else is going on during sex. You'd be like, fuck it. This pain hurts badly. Right. So, Charlie, so, so what's the worst? Kicked in the nuts. So what's what's worse? Getting no, what's worse? Oh, Charlie kicked in the nuts. Right, the back of the leg, hamstring. Getting, I don't know. That, that that might that might be equal, dog. I I didn't even go. Nah, hold you. Charlie horse. 
No, no, no. Okay, wait, wait. Listen, listen. Because it's a couple I, I, Charlie horses that's bad. It, it's the one, the one, the one when you having sex is bad. But the one that wake no, you up in the bad. middle of the night, bro. That, I'm, not, I'm, I'm not old enough. For that. I'm, I'm not old enough. For Have that. you ever had one of those, Brian? Yes, and I'm talking about you yo, sleep. I felt like I've, I've never had that. I'm talking about you sleep. You know what that's like? That's like in Baby Boy when Ving Ray, when Ving Rhames called Baby Boy slacking <laughs> he in the headlock. Slipping. When he was sleeping, he's like, yeah, nigga. Yeah, you. Mama. Oh, mama. And you just can't move, bro. Yeah. Wait, Jay, you never caught the nighttime Charlie stuck. horse? I've never in my life had a Charlie horse in while I was asleep. No. Oh, I don't. It, hey, you see how you say you don't wish it kicked to the nuts on no neck? No, no, okay, so honestly, y'all oh, need, need to stretch. Y'all need to stretch. I'm, I'm, I'm alarmed. Y'all have Charlie horses while it's, sleeping. Some, it's not even about. But you're sleeping. It's not even that. Like. It's just bro, position. I, your leg could be in a certain position bro, for too long. Yeah, and your little muscle will be bro. like, ha-ha. Ah! <laughs> like, you know. Gotcha. Gotcha. Ah, ah. And that shit, that, shit that. Feed, that shit feed you out. And now I don't know, dude. Like, I don't know. You need some more potassium. <laughs> yeah, you need, you need, some, you need some bananas. You got to eat some bananas. Nigga, some plants. Yeah, potassium oh, level. I have, level seen, this, I have seen, yeah, that I have seen night. Charlie Horses cripple some of the greatest of men. <laughs> you understand? <laughs> like I'm talking about. I just, I just never. K O game. I never, I never had a Charlie horse affect me while I was sleeping. But if we talk about during sex, yes, You've I've had been the, there. The during sex one. Yes, I've been there. So that, if she's that, on top of you. You throw her off of you. To be honest, okay. So I never had a Charlie horse while somebody was on top of me. It's always when. Charlie... Yeah, I, I've had yeah. one, but I, but it's always when I'm I'm you know I'm on top of whatever. Yes, yeah. yes, yeah. yes. For the most part, on the Charlie horse. Yeah. yeah, I've never had a Charlie. I horse have horse. had to throw someone off before. I have had to throw Boy, someone. Boy, I caught one. Well, I caught one right here on the left hamstring. God, sweat it on on my mama. I said, huh. she said, what happened? I said, listen, move, don't touch me, don't. I'm talking about the left hamstring locked up. She was yeah. on top rotted, and I should said, "Come here, motherfucker, <laughs> stupid!" I was like, ah, ah. "Bro, yeah, I, bro. I never had, I never had bro. that experience." Right, and it's it's know. embarrassing, Duh. but you don't care. Like I don't no, care. What like, ass she naked? Was like ah, she was ah, mad. I don't give a damn. This is imp- I don't she give a was shit. Mad. She I don't was care mad. how. Like, why do you have to throw me? I said, listen. You'll be all right. Listen. Y'all need some potassium. Listen. Y'all potassium <laughs> levels is low. Mm-hmm. Listen. Yo, no, at that point, you need a new low. body. At that point, you like, give me a new yeah, body. You be like, can I, yo, can I trade this one in? Like, can I take this one back? This one defective, nigga. I shouldn't be having. <laughs> Stupid. <'Cause> that <laughs> shit. Where that is shit my receipt? You, that <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Because like I said, Mm-mm. a kick to the nuts, you feel like shit. You feel like shit come up all your way to your stomach. I still think it kicked to the nuts. Work though, bro. I'm, I'm in my head. It, 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 it's worse. It's worse. I don't care what y'all talking about. A kick to the nuts is worse than all of that. A Charlie horse is a close second. A close second. It's not even close, close to me. It's not even close. Nah, Have you bro. ever been kicked in? I don't think you, you've been kicked in your nuts before. But you never, you never had a Charlie horse in your sleep. That's what I'm saying. That you no, that sleep Charlie horse is is a mother. Ooh. Bro, but you've never been kicked, bro. Think, think, okay, so how about I, this? Oh, I, I put it. This, I've been kicked. I put it this way. Wait, wait. I have been kicked in the nuts. I put it. I put it this way. Name the most sensitive part of your body. No, yeah, it's of course it's your dick. As I mean, man, it's your nuts and your baby toe. Ex- ex- exactly. So imagine being yeah, kicked sure. there. What? No, no, I, bro. I'm not saying you're wrong. It the is, most it is I the never worst I never been um, it is I never been place. kicked. It is. But the most that's ever happened is a kid has punched me. You know how kids punch you and they they they, they short. So and you feel that shit. Yeah, you like, oh yo. Yeah. <laughs> yeah so yeah. imagine somebody winding up and kicking you there. Mm, nah, yeah, bro. Yeah. I'll I'll take anything but that. Yeah. Shit. Jesus was on the cross. I'll take the nails. <laughs> Damn. Give me the nails in my hands. <laughs> nigga, a nigga said I kick to the nuts. <laughs> nigga said I kick to the nuts. I'm nah. good. You got head. That um, is because, like I said, me. I'm not hey. saying a kick to the a kick to the nuts is worse. You're right. But a Charlie horse is a close second, bro. 
The only reason why I say it is like Dave said, when you're not expecting that motherfucker, you sleep in your third dream. You and then chilling. that shit just come out of nowhere and legit just lock up on you. Yeah. And the way it lock up on you, you can't fuck getting up to run to try to stretch it out. You're on that bed, locked in the position you also sleepy. until they decide to let go. You understand? You also sleepy. You know, you ever try to get up like sleepy? You you, you fall. You know, you don't have your equilibrium. <laughs> so, shit. You know what I mean? You, you ever try to get up really fast? Bad. Like you somebody call fall. you, hey, come on, you let's go the, right now. You like, oh, boom, you bust your ass. You know, you ain't, I'm not. You got the Bambi legs. Yeah. That's so what you it is. Up, Bambi. That Charlie, I, I'm so I, imagine I, listen, the, I, bro, I've done that before. I've had to, I've had to roll off the bed and like, because I'm asleep already, you know what I'm saying? So I barely understand. I just, I'm just like, ah! I just wake up in pain. I, I like fell off the bed and I'm like rolling on the ground trying to figure out what the fuck is happening. Cause what the fuck is this pain? Yeah, that I'm got even shot. Wow. <laughs> yeah, that's how I feel. <laughs> that's... Mm -mm. Mm -mm. But yeah, nuts is still worse though. I just want to point that out. I think I, that's, that's all I'm saying. I, yeah, I, I hear I what y'all talking about. But, yeah. Mm -mm. I gotta yeah. pick a pain. I would pick Charlie Horse over. It, it, listen, over it, kick, kick them nuts. Because you can breathe out the Charlie Horse. You can, you can. Facts. You can. <laughs> facts. You can massage it. You know what I'm saying? You can rub it out. You can rub it out. You can, you can rub that shit out. You can't rub that out. Nope. You can't. You know. You Ain't can't breathe it. that out. Nigga said that shit just gotta go away when it go away. You can't just, even. You yeah, feel like you can't yeah. breathe when you get kicked in the nuts. You just. No, yeah, no, take your breath. No facts, like it's facts. <laughs> <laughs> is it? Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Like I've heard, I've heard women mm -mm. try to equate getting hit in their breasts to get hit kicked in your nuts, right? That's what I've heard women say. Oh, see no. how like when y'all get kicked in your nuts, it's you like getting, it's yeah, like okay, okay, you know, okay. That's you know what I've heard. Shit. That's bullshit. That. I'll that's let what you what go, Jay. You know what I hate, and I I may take some flack here because this is an all man show and uh -oh. this that, but. I hate women trying to to diminish our pain by including their pain. Don't do that. Don't do that. I'm, no, don't. No, no. You 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 have no clue what's going on. And furthermore, what may happen to you may hurt to you. But don't try to equate that to what we're talking about because it's two different levels of pain. Like you can't. Yeah. You can't like, possibly understand what happens when somebody gets kicked in their nuts because you don't got those. Getting kicked in your nuts is like the kill switch for men, period. Bro, yes. You know what I'm saying? It's a kill switch. It's like it's literally like it's like hitting the off button yes. on the machine. It's like you just that is that's Bro, everything. Especially yeah. if you get the if you get the good kick. The yeah. career because you know like you can get some thigh. If you get the thigh, it's not gonna hurt. <laughs> but if right. you kick, if you kick and you hit for real. Right, I don't. No man on earth can overcome that. But you know that's that's what they teach in like self defense classes. You know, for they women. But yeah. but they should. They should. Yeah, they teach they oh, teach yeah. women. They teach women how to, um, push, and deflect punches, and then to throw you off and then get you in the nuts because they know that that's the. That's your, you know, bro. It's the, it's the it's the most sensitive spot on any man's body, right? So if you no, if think you about are, it. If you're really, if you're a really bro, big you, guy, you, let's say you, you let's say you bro. six six, and you you trying to grab up on some girl five one, you know, you, you just she's just a really big guy, you, my nigga. You can go to the gym, it, hit them nuts, bro. You LeBron can, James ain't taking that nut hit. Bro, <laughs> you can, can go to the gym and work out every muscle in your body, but mm -hmm. that. No, 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 that's a fact. You can't you get a stronger yeah, bro. Yeah, yeah. You you can't get a stronger nutsack, bro. Like you can't. Is you that can't. the is that why? I think bro, you can't work no out. There's no muscles in your balls. There's no muscle. <laughs> bro, it is the most vulnerable part of the body for a man. So no matter what you're talking about, like you know, it's hey, over listen. for you. No, legit, lady, listen, oh, if you actually, if you are really if you are getting chased or you can build or muscle in the women in bre in female for for women breasts you can build muscle in the you breasts can. you can yeah because we see women bodybuilders they look like bari look like they got strong ass pecs right that's what they got <laughs> but 
You can't have no strong ass pecs in the nuts. It's impossible. There's no muscle down there. I learned two things today. I learned that Jewish people don't fish. And um, I learned that there's no muscles in your balls. This is a very... It's informative. I've, I've, I've taken something from this today. I, I never, I never thought about that. Jewish people don't fish. Jewish <laughs> people don't fish. <laughs> there's no muscles Yo, in they... your balls. Yo, they gonna kill us for that one. Not Yo, yeah, no, we kill us for that. Oh shit! Mm. Jewish people don't fish, mind you. What if there's <laughs> like a, a funny whole concept. community? Yo, what if there's a whole community, motherfuckers, talking about you? You don't know what you're speaking. Jewish, on, yeah, imagine Jewish fishers. The, the <laughs> Jewish to fishers us. club. <laughs> <laughs> the JFC, <Bro>. nigga. <laughs> the Jewish <laughs> fishers <laughs> club. <laughs> Yo, no, I'm we so gotta sorry go. To bring that back, but that's just a late. I'm, no, man, I'm gonna go. be at work tomorrow. Like, yo, Jewish people don't fish, no, <laughs> or do they? Go. I don't know. I just think it's hilarious. No, we gotta go. We yo, gotta go. do we have anything else to talk about? <laughs> nah, that's it. Bro. Right, I don't know why that's so funny to me. <laughs> no, nah, that's it. That's I've never it. heard a that's story it. like an old school. Like, so when I was a boy, <laughs> I never. Oh, a, a, a young rabbi. <laughs> Yeah, I never heard that story. All right, all right, all right, all right. No, 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 we got to go. Yo, thank you for watching Willow Wednesdays. Please go, go stream uh, Water, Skate 107. <laughs> fucking uh, go tell a friend to tell a friend to watch Willow Wednesdays because these niggas is fucking characters, all right? Yo, we out of here, yo, because these niggas is stupid. <laughs> yo, man, see y'all next week. <laughs> a young rabbi. <laughs> Man, I just want to thank you so much for tuning into Willow Wednesdays. We love and appreciate facts, the support. Facts, facts. Yeah, yeah. If you ain't done so already, please hit the like and subscribe button for the YouTube page. Big facts. Yes, yes, yes. And click the bell for notifications. Mm-hmm. And make sure to join that family page, the Willow Wednesday family page on Facebook. Mm-hmm. Peace.